Explaining the entire plot of Persona 5 in one minute. You're a high school student shipped to the mean streets of Tokyo from your rural hometown as part of a probation you earned by beating the shit out of a piece of shit. But everyone in Tokyo labels you as a thug the second you show up because they don't know the piece of shit you beat the shit out of was a piece of shit. Because of that label, your goal is to not ruffle any feathers and worsen your public perception, but oopsie doodle turns out the new school you go to has a separate piece of shit from the first one and you just can't help yourself, can you? You, two new friends who are wrong by this man in different ways, and a talking not a cat cat set up to reveal his villainy. But you don't know how until you discover the existence of a secret world where you can manipulate individuals by taking away their bad intentions until they're left with nothing but the good stuff. Your venture works and the piece of shit reveals its true colors and the four of you decide that helping folks is tight and you should do more of it. Your group decides to target criminals, and as your targets become more high profile, you gain more cohorts and national fame. Some big baddies take advantage of that by killing one of their enemies and blaming it on you, uh-oh. The world now hates you, so you set out to prove your innocence by doing the same shit that got you in trouble, you dogs, you. Along the way, you figured out who framed you and who the biggest baddie of them all is, and guess what? It's the original piece of shit from the beginning. You take his desires to make him a good guy, but the world doesn't care because an evil deity is manipulating them, so you shoot God through the goddamn cranium and free the world of their mind prison.